time for a pull of Anima Christmas. One of my favorites. Elf! Ah! Oh, very fun, very fun. Buddy the Elf. Oh! Played by Will Ferrell. The role he was born to play. Oh my goodness. Buddy the Elf accidentally sneaks in to uh, Santa's sack and gets taken up to the North Pole. As a baby. As a baby. Uh, but he's a human baby, so he's already the size of the elves. You know what I mean? But then he's raised by elves. Not wolves. Elves. Mm -hmm. He uh, is there, and then he's like, he never fits in. He's the only baritone in the choir, which is kind of fun. He stands out. <laughs> and then he uh he then decides he's like hey i don't fit in here he overhears someone saying that he is a uh human being and that he just hasn't figured out yes so he's like well, i gotta find my real dad and so his dad elf papa elf uh tells him all about his dad who's on the naughty list oh, the bad man. <laughs> he's the bad man and so he gives him a picture he was apparently um given up for adoption by susan wells and uh, he goes to New York City, where you don't eat the gum. It's not free candy. And he <laughs> gets there. He finds his dad, who is on the naughty list. He's a bad boy. Uh, and he writes children's stories. <laughs> and he says, <laughs> he goes, you're my real dad. But he's like, this guy's a joke. But then they do a paternal test. Mm. He is a real dad. Oh, wow. He then meets Zoe Deschanel, who is a blonde. Mm. Kills it. Mm. They uh, slowly fall in love. She also thinks he's mentally deranged because he is. Uh, we like that in men. But it's very fun. You know, like a magnet, those <laughs> broken boys. <laughs> uh, you do he's an elf? I can work with that. Yeah, at least he's got a job. <laughs> Mary Steamgarden plays his dad's new wife, who is... This woman is just incredible. You put her in a cast, and she just knocks it out of the park. So they also have another kid. So Buddy the Elf befriends him after, you know, he has to work on it because everybody thinks he's weird because he's drinking syrup and eating cotton balls where he's at the doctor's office. He's made finger has a heartbeat and so what happens is he picks the kid up from school and <laughs> yeah they have a i'm sure you caught that but they had a snowball fight and obviously buddy the elf is exceptional <laughs> exceptional so he wins over the kid they start having tons of fun they get a huge tree they try to <laughs> stick it in will ferrell jumps on and falls over. i mean some scenes that just you have to rewind the <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then he falls. And then he's working at Macy's in the Santa. Gimbal. You know, they call it gimbals. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry. Excuse me. I blaspheme. And he um, re comes in late at night and redoes Sick Christmas Land because he goes, Santa's coming! And then obviously it's not the real Santa. Uh -huh. And he thinks it's the real Santa. So he goes over to the guy and he goes, you sit on a throne of lies. So then he gets kicked out of there. Then his dad comes and gets him in jail, and that's when he gets the paternity test. So we're caught up. I just had to add those other things in, but I had my <laughs> mouth full. And then, um, so then, do you want to pick it up from there? He has to go to work with his dad because they realize they can't leave him home alone. So he goes to work with his dad, and then his dad sends him down to the mail room. But in the he, what's your favorite color? And he gets tanked because he thinks that whiskey is, is syrup. syrup. And then so he's dancing on a table. Hey! And then they bring in uh, Tyrion Lannister from Game of Thrones yes. to write a children's book. And he's so funny because he wants when the car picks it up to be 71.8 degrees or however yes. much it is in Celsius. Mm -hmm. Not a degree more or less. And also, uh, Buddy comes in, thinks he's an elf. He goes, he's an angry elf. And then that guy gets pissed because uh, he, oh. because he's supposed to uh, write a children's book that's going to save the company. But then he leaves. But he leaves his little book of ideas behind. And so then they're like, oh, we can do this. <laughs> yes, but everybody gets mad at Buddy the Elf because he's so weird. And including his dad. Uh, and he goes and runs away. And he's like, nobody wants me. I don't belong anywhere. Mm. Which seems to be a theme of these Christmas movies. Yeah. Feeling lost. And then Santa finds you because he crashes his sled in the middle of Central Park, and then the Central Park Rangers, their very angry horses, uh, come to try and uh, get, kill him? Oh, oh. I mean, it's very serious. And so Buddy the Elf finds him in Central Park, but he's the only one that could fit the Santa claus o -meter rocket. <laughs> yep, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> yep, we got it. Uh, he, he fixes it. <laughs> and then uh, the dad 
and the brother, they're like, hey, we're going to help out of the elf because we believe him now. And then they go down there and they're like, we love you. And everybody gets along. And then uh, 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 they get the sleigh moving and then uh, she sings. Zoe Deschanel sings and helps the Christmas spirit. And then the kid goes and get, tells the list on the television station to bring the Christmas spirit. And then um, and then they start singing and then the sleigh flies all on its own, just like the old days. And then uh, Christmas is saved, and then all the presents get returned, and then Betty, uh, Buddy the Elf falls in love with Zoe Deschanel, whose character I don't remember her name. They live happily ever after, and they uh, become a family, and then they have a baby, and they bring it up to the North Pole! Mm. I mean, mm. Merry Christmas. Merry 